before I came to Marshall, I went to the service to the Navy during the Korean War. It's been four years. And uh, during this time, I've married and had, I had a wife. And uh, then after I got out of uh, the service, and I had a job, full-time job here in Huntington, but I decided that I really wanted to do more than that and that I really needed to finish my formal education. So Marshall was convenient is the reason I came. And uh, so I came to Marshall, I was a sophomore, and uh, about two and a half years to finish up, I guess, working full-time and 48 hours a week, as a matter of fact, and going to school. Uh, so it was it was tough, but the reason was it was a convenience thing for me as far as coming to Marshall. I guess that I have always liked giving, uh, doing things for without a price being on them for people and so forth. But after I worked, after I graduated from Marshall, I went back to the Navy and spent just a short time and I washed out of flight school and came back and got a job with a, our pharmaceutical manufacturer, an excellent job. And after I retired from them, uh, I had spare, spare time on my hands. And the reason we chose Marshall when I graduated from here, so it helped me gain a formal education. But two, uh, it's, it's served the area so well. You know, kids from Fort Gay and that area, uh, they don't have to go to the West Virginia University or the University of Kentucky or wherever. And Marshall had a good record in terms of educating kids. Uh, Marshall's focus when I was a student here was primarily education, teaching kids uh, who would come to school to become school teachers and be leaders in that area. Uh, so we just, and that's where we ended up and we have been so blessed. Uh, Marshall, I think if I were doing it over again, the only thing I would do different is I would start it much earlier uh, because it was just waiting there for somebody and that was us, fortunately. Thank you.